Hey, what's up guys? Coach Wood here, heading to an appointment, so I thought I would make a quick video here. Trust me, I am watching the road, I'm being safe here. The ashtray makes a perfect little prop for a, for a camera. But uh, anyway, a lot of times I hear from, uh, from coaches, I can't, I don't know anybody, I can't talk to anybody else, I've already dried up my warm market. That happens to everybody. That happens to everybody that coaches because you don't know every single person out there, right? Um, it's happened to me. It happens to the best coaches that are out there. It's just one of those situations where you've got to get uncomfortable. Uh, you've got to reach out to more people than you ever have. You've got to make more connections. You've got to make more friends. And that may seem weird. It may seem creepy to you. I'm stopped at a stoplight now. That may seem weird or creepy to you, but... The harsh reality is this business means you get uncomfortable and if you really want to make it work you've got to make more connections because those connections will have other connections and it just kind of ripples and spider webs from there i've um, i've got a document that i'm going to share with you guys um, that i am using now every day to track how many well before i was using a notepad now i'm using an actual form but it's to track how many people you're reaching out to per day how many people you're presenting the business to, how many people you're inviting to challenge groups, are you doing your personal development, are you drinking your Shakeology, are you doing your workout, all of these things that have to do with those vital behaviors that we learn about very early in coaching, inviting, uh, being a product to product, personal development, and now there's kind of a fourth one of recognition, but... Um, <clears throat> Those are the things that you have to do if you want to be successful as a coach, even mildly successful as a coach. Maybe, maybe you don't want to do this full time. That's not for you. Totally, totally get it. But maybe you want to make your car payment with your earnings from Beachbody. Maybe you want to pay your electric bill. Maybe you want to take your spouse or significant other out to dinner or buy them something nice. Whatever. It doesn't matter. Your Everybody's goals are different. But if you want to do well or at least somewhat well you're gonna to have to do things that don't feel right and anybody that you talk to that has anything to do with um, with, with business especially network marketing um, is gonna tell you that you just simply have to talk to more people and that's how I every month make 25 or so success club points um, because I'm talking to new people I'm talking to people I'm talking to some existing people that I've talked to in the past but I'm continuing to talk to people and that's what makes the difference and then you put our good products in somebody's hands and they get good results guess what they're talking to their friends about it then their friends are gonna ask about it then you're gonna get referrals and things will just keep moving but um, you're, you're gonna have to do some things that are a little different than what you're used to so reach out to people. You know what I've been using a lot lately is that uh, Friends You May Know, I think it's called. And it pops up in my news feed every day. I may be laying in bed before I even get out of bed in the morning and looking at that thing. I'll add four or five people. I'm adding at least five or more people every single day. Every day I'm adding those people. So um, it may seem weird. Some may accept, some may not. So what? I mean, you know, you're just trying to make connections with people. If they, if your friends know them, then it won't seem that creepy for you to reach out to them. Um, but uh, that kind of stuff works. It builds up your builds up your network. It increases the amount of people that see what you're doing. So it's going to increase visibility for people to come to you. Or if you want to reach out to people as well, people that you send friend requests to, check their time, check their timeline, look at their feed and see if it's uh, if you think it's somebody that you would you want to reach out to to help or if you think it's somebody that would appreciate the business opportunity whatever the case may be we're in a people business right we're, we're in the business of relationships and the more relationships that you build and the more people that you meet the more successful you're going to be all right hope this is helpful I'll talk to you later hope you're having a great day bye